And welcome back everybody, Sign here again with another episode of my 500 Day Stalker playthrough. And, uh, yeah. In the dam still. Alright. Too bad I can't break this door down, because there's another toilet behind there. Sometimes this door is, like, open. It's like a third toilet that you can fish water out of. Oh yeah, speaking of water though. Do 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 do. I hate how slow this is. But uh we are good on water now. And we're good on food. So, um bunch of wolf and uh Good amount of moose here too. That's uh what twenty eight moose steaks. Are you guys still over there, huh? Yeah, that wolf over there uh, respawned. So I shot him again. Because you know that's what you do. You shoot wolves right in the face as they charge at you. That's him right there. This isn't oh the one that was down by the derailment. All right. Um, do, 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 do. probably don't need that on me right this. Oh, damn, too heavy. Also, I found my curator's rifle. I yeah, it's gonna stay there for the rest of the playthrough because I can't access it. Uh, that was not a smart thing to do. All right, was there anything else in here that I can? Like shred or whatnot. There was a cardboard that was there, the light fixture, and that—that's kind of it. All right. Well, bathroom's done. And let's see. Those are empty. Okay. Well, that was quick. This one. This little area here is not going to be so quick. The hell did I just get stuck on? Uh, let's go ahead and have the rest of our bass here. Yeah, I think I made like eight gallons of water or so. So we should be good on water for a while. Food, I'll probably have to go out and either... That was a really weird, like, metallic dropping sound, wasn't it? Yeah, food, I'll have to go out either raid my stores back at camp office. Or just go hunting again. When I was coming back with my stuff... Uh, there were three deer down by where I lost that one, so. Alright. Well, the skip's not going to do any good. Okay, so this area's done. Oh, no, no. Need to repair my hacksaw now, too. Here we go. That was a very short aurora, wasn't it? Alright, uh, tools. All right. Hacksaw. There we go. Okay, my toolkit's at 62%. So, need to keep an eye on that. Really? Double Aurora? Okay. And it's still the same night, so...
I think we were on day 320, whenever I started recording. Or, yeah, survived 320 days. Since it never actually lines up, because you don't usually spawn at midnight on day one, so... I mean, if you do, then it will match up perfectly. Alright. Grab some food now. Well, let me drop at least the wood off. 30 more pieces of scrap. Um, I was putting this stuff in this filing cabinet, wasn't I? Yeah. So we can put 50 per drawer. Okay, I mean, that's not terrible. Hmm. Sounds nasty outside. Just windy. Okay. Never have picked up the rabbits yet. Not too concerned about it, really. Alright, and... Water. Get some more sleep in. Honestly, I could be going without water the entire day. Uh, speaking of, how much was that? Yeah. And then just drinking water right before bed. I can stretch it out further that way, but... I don't usually like min-maxing stuff like that. Another Aurora. Okay. Like three Auroras in two days. There it goes. You go ahead and have some food, more water. Now, the main reason to be doing this is actually to like find anything hidden in the crates, but decide I'm just gonna, you know, destroy everything. Uh, you are a thing I can <laughs> soft as well, actually. Yeah. All right. Tired, really. Okay. Keep going. And nothing. Okay. So that's done. I got those boxes there. Got a lot of stuff here to break up. minutes. Not sure why not. At least more durability on my axe. Decided there wasn't much point in using the knife for this. I got it sharpened up and I was like, you know, I'm gonna need to save my whetstone for the hatchet, so.
About time to go get food again, though, it looks like. Alright, so I just have the two shelves there. I got this table, too. Yeah, let's go ahead and... That, we got a chair, shelf, and a table. Two chairs. Okay. So we're gonna be in there for a while, too, it looks like. No metal this time, okay. You know what, here, you, all my tinder plugs. Alright, and more sleep. Whenever I get done up here, wow, that was a lag spike. I need to move a bunch of food and stuff down into the, the large room because I could get stranded down there during an aurora and... Uh, That would not be good. Yeah, I wish we could use the wheelbarrows. You think about it, it's a Troy with a wheel on it, so you can push or pull it. I mean, even you could only use it inside the buildings, you know. If you find one of those, like, in a mine shaft, that would be awesome. You pile it full of coal and just haul it to the, in, you know, to the exits. Alright, time to fix the hacksaw again. It does not take long to break this thing down. At least we're up to 85% chance of repair. 86% now. Alright. soon. Yeah, it's feeling a lot more open in here now, isn't it, though? I need to sleep. I would drink almost anything about now. That's just, I'm going to have so much scrap metal. <laughs> I mean. 
Yeah, let's go ahead and just grab another one of these. No roar tonight. All right. Falling stuff down too, it takes a lot of energy, or a lot of, uh, a lot out of your food bar. And, we're done. For this room. Yeah, I know, it feels a lot more barren in here now, doesn't it? So we have a ladder that I can't, okay, can't do anything with. Lockers are empty, just a door taken off the hinges. All right, now, be something hiding in the crate, would you, nope. All we have left now is the big room. Oh, this is going to take forever in here. All right, how much food do I have on me? I have one piece of the wolf. I need to go grab some food. Maybe snag another bottle of water while we're at it. Hey, the crows are gone, so that means the wolf carcass is gone, too. Wow, the more stuff I've removed from here, the longer the game has taken to save. That is not something I expected to happen, honestly. Nope, nothing. All right, is there any other... Well, there's a box here, I guess. Let's look for crates. Doesn't look like it. All right, any other small stuff? Um, oh, there's this. I need to sharpen this thing. I'm, I'll sharpen it once to get it out of the yellow, but uh, there's nothing in here to chop up. I don't need to worry about it too much right this second. All right, well, I guess let's get started on this, right? All right, that room's done. And uh, I'm all sorts of fat and slow right now because I've got all my food and water on me. 
Gonna relocate past the, zip, the uh, zappy wires here. And start working on the big room. But you can't, like, scavenge the video cameras, you know? Grab, like, a protective lens out of them or something. Make, like, a, a jerry rig mag lens for yourself. Yeah, these wires here are the ones that'll get you, so. Uh, downside of this is going to be, I don't have anywhere to store. Uh, there is, like, a locker or two, isn't there, in here? Lockers don't, they're not going to hold enough, though. You know, they don't have anywhere really to store the metal. And that much metal is going to be a pain to, uh, to pick up off the ground. Uh, let's see, there is a locker up in that corner. I think that's it. Oh, no, there's, no, that's just shelves. Okay. All right, let me... Food. Yeah, I got a lot. A lot, a lot on me. I got four gallons of water. I went and got my pot and skillet as well, because, well, we've got a fire barrel right here. So if I need water, which I might, then we'll be good to go. Well, I got the big room done. It was a bunch of wood. Not so much metal and whatnot. I never searched these. Oh, no. I didn't. Oh. Wow. Well, it took me like 330 days to find out. Oh, some tarps here it looks like, too. One thing I did find, though, was another toolbox. Just tucked in the corner of the big room up there. So I was like, oh, sweet. I did have to go back to the camp office, though. And I had to uh, get another whetstone. Oh, and while I was out and about doing that, I uh, killed a couple of deer. There we go. And that oh, was just like a paint can lid. Okay. So far, I've already filled that one up. All right. Save. Thank you. Haven't had that bug in a while, but I'm just being careful. Yeah, I cooked up the venison, made a bunch more water, hauled it all down here, and, uh, yeah. Oh, I need to break this down still. I'm moving on to the rest of the dam now. All right, so I'm in here, and, you know, the underside of the turbine room. There was a skill book right here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, Frontier Shooting Guides. I mean, nothing really all that important. But it was kind of... It was right there. But you can't get to it unless you break down the chair that was right here. So, if you're willing to, you know, sop the chair, you, you might get a free skill book back there, which is cool. Probably might have been able to see, like, a corner of it from here to let you know that it's actually there. Uh, let's 
let's see. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Much water. I'm kind of low on water, actually. You know what? Let's let's break this. And I got a couple of cardboard boxes here to grab. But first, I am going to go back to where I've got my food and water stash. Because I don't want to get stuck in this room. But I got this room cleaned out. Um, yeah, there was a... Uh, was it? It was this trash can had a revolver shell casing in it. So apparently I just forgot to loot, you know, part of the dam. And I also found a can of spray paint, so that was in the other trash can, I think. All right, let me get this stuff dropped off then. Another 140 metal right in there. Plus close to 200 up by the other entrance. Um, yeah. Yeah, 29%. I have to rip I have to sharpen this. Alright, almost done. Let's see. This room's completed. Finally. I kept finding, like, I found a metal pail hidden, like, back here. I found a couple planks leaning up against the wall of the... I don't think I can reach those ones there, but like those. Uh, let's see, yeah. Emptied all this out. And then there was a few odds and ends down this hallway. Got it underneath the stairs all cleaned out. And now we just have to go upstairs. I've gone through three whetstones, almost an entire uh, toolkit uh, for fixing my hacksaw. It's been a little hard on the materials, but uh, we're almost there. And we got a lot of metal and wood out of this. And a whole bunch of tinder, too, actually. Which I have no use for, but might as well collect it, right? Well, uh, oh hey, I almost missed you. The fire pack mod makes it so that I can craft fire logs out of tinder. And water. So, yeah, I'll probably be doing that. I'm going to hold off on these last two crates and take a peek around. See what all there is for wood left because we got crates there. Uh, like crates, I can break down by hand if I have to. But seeing as I can't sharpen my hatchet anymore, I want to make sure I wasn't going to get stranded with some... Uh, <laughs> needs this anymore. Like planks or something. Planks or pallets or whatnot. Uh, looks like we are good, though. Okay, cool. I should have enough durability on my hatchet to break down all the crates. And if not, I can always just kick them apart, too. So, just takes longer. Alright.
And I've blown through almost that entire... Uh, I want to say it was like half of a moose I brought over. There's a lot of food. Okay. Now, I'm kind of curious. Okay. Since this chair is upside down, how is it going to look I take out the shelf from underneath it? Oh, it's just gone. Oh, whoops. Oh, well. Alright, so we do have some cardboard here to break down. And... Eat my last piece of moose. About over, I think it was like 32 pieces of moose in total. So I've gone through a bunch of calories. Also, we're, I think, on day 340 now. I'm getting tired. I think I started at, like, day 302. I might actually have to go back and get more food before I can finish this area up. Because I really don't want to lose my well-fed. Yeah, we're going to have to. Because I still have a shelf here, plus everything in this room. So, what is... Oh, it's a radio up there. Okay. That's like a cup or something. Alright, long hike back now. Thankfully, it's not an Aurora, so... Alright, I found my first thing in this half of the dam that was under something. There were some empty lockers here, broken lockers, and there was an accelerant under one of them. <laughs> oh, sometimes. Can I break down this tub? No. All right, well, hmm. there's a broom here I can break down. Like, all the wood pieces out of here, I think, right? The rest is all metal. Yeah, metal table. I can break those both down. Desk, I can't touch. I can do the chair, though. And then I've got a bunch of shelves left. And we have a chair over here. But this table here you cannot break down. All because it's got the sink, you know, resting on it or whatnot. Need to rest <laughs> Better brought a little more water with me, I think. broke the toolkit. Bit of a shame. Uh, you can repair simple tools with... Uh... Oh, look at you. Nice. Uh, what is it? The uh, fancy tools, right? Whatever they're called. The red box. Oh. I found more things that I missed than I have, you know, found things that are hidden. Exhausted. I'm almost out of water again. I brought over a gallon with me. Okay, we have a floating computer. Oh, because this is um, buffer memories on that one. 
So obviously you're not going to be able to, you know, make that go away. My lantern too far away? Okay, fine. Do this one then. Okay, microwave's on the ground now. Almost out of venison as well. Dang. Uh, yeah, and this is the last of my water. But I only have... Like two shells left. And now it's an Aurora, so I'm stuck here. Okay, I've got a shelf and a chair left. Uh, yeah. What have we got? Bought that local trapper again, our ghost. This time he was lurking out beyond the banish of the dam's property. Seems to know some hidden trails to pass over to Winding River without dealing with our fence line. Next quarter's budget, please send some company reps to make contact with him. We badly need the local help, and he might be a good contact. <laughs> wonder if that was Methuselah. Let's go ahead and eat this. I can take the dehydration damage, so... Alright. We'll check. Yeah, that should be pretty much everything. Let's just hope my saw doesn't break doing this. Nope, we're good. Oh, the aurora was over with already? Oh, well, yeah, it's fully into the day now. Alright. Much? 69%. Okay. That is everything that you can be harvested out of the dam, harvested now. Just do a quick double check while I'm walking back to where I can sleep. Okay, that one's not harvestable. Some of the boxes on the wall actually are, so. So I wonder if that one there is. Uh, if it is, it's out of reach, so. Oh, there goes my water. That's harvestable. No, it's not. Okay. Some of the ones that are actually on, you know, the green cabinets are harvestable. That one is. Do, 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 do. Thankfully, I have some fish left. That's a bass, right? There we go. Simple tools so I can repair my hacksaw. Plenty of water now. And that's 88 pounds of metal in this filing cabinet. Plus another 47 pounds over here. Wow, that's 307 metal. So the item picker mod has an option that you can turn off item inspection for every item. And it makes picking up large, you know, piles like this so much quicker. Alright, I can move. Wow, okay. Amazing. Uh, we have currently... 185 wood. Wow. That's kind of crazy. All right. 
and I got every bit of wood, minus I think ten pieces I used whenever I uh, was cooking up the deer. 461 total for the entire damn, well, 471. And just shy of 600 metal. It's spread out among different things. 134 tender. Yeah. Uh, this is... I should probably take this back, actually, and leave it by my outside fires. It's going to be a pain, though, because it's going to be two trips of the triple way just for the wood alone. But I think I'm going to go ahead and call this an episode. Um, well, let me check here. We are uh, 340 days survived now. So that did eat up quite a bit of time, which is what I was hoping for. And... Done. All right. So, yeah. One thing on my checklist. Um, I still have to go back to Forsaken Airfield and Pleasant Valley for for these and Timberwolf. So I I know I found two in Timberwolf. So, but thank you for coming out. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And until the next one, sign signing out. Have fun.